let's get on let's get on top of the ziggurat right here. Just kinda There we go. There we go! Alright, so I can get up here. And maybe this will give me the vision to be able to um see where I'm going in inside this tower. You know, maybe I maybe I should have put a bit more thought into this. Alright, so we need to go. Up. Sometimes it's a little bit finicky. Ah! Enemy! I forgot! I forgot they respawn! <laughs> to my side, uh, my noble Einherjar. These beasts are much too dangerous. Yeah! Huh? Now, on the plus side, we're getting plenty of experience, I guess. If you wish to count that. Alright, hopefully get a whole bunch of charge crystals so our casters are online and ready to fuck them. Ugh. Dang, both of them trying to take on Yume. Yume having absolutely none of that. Alright, I don't want to kill one. So we're just going to get both of them kind of low. Ooh, yikes. That's a little too low for my taste. Ah, Valkyrie eating the counterattack. Oh, thank you for the head pass. I won't lose. Yee. We're down to pocket size. It's the witch's hats. They're uh they're, they're making me tiny. Making me tiny bitty. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. I think both of them should be able to die with one magic cast. You may. Um Freeze them. Yeah, try and possess this pants grab. Their souls have been released. <laughs> we have no reason to remain here. Rapid bow, rapid bow, rapid bow, rapid bow. Give me all your rapid bows. All right, so we need this. Close. I can't forget all boops. I think I think in the future I need to invest in like a proper teapot of some kind. Cause I have been using <laughs> a um uh like a measuring cup. 
to the Steep My DM, and uh, it's a limited amount of space. Um, an e exactly limited amount of space. <laughs> I mean, I do have a kettle, but it still takes a good like it's it's a, it's a really cheap one. It doesn't get up to temp very fast. Um, Let us be gone from even when I like limit the water to like just roughly as much as I'm going to use, you know, water has a really high heat capacity. It takes a lot of energy to heat up, and it retains that heat very well. I'm... Did I take a wrong turn? I think I did. But I shouldn't have seen a beast. It should have been a dragon. Drecky has gotten turned around, it seems. To my side, my noble Alright, we got some I fatal glimmers. Enough. We'll see who's fatal to who. Yeah. Ha. Ha. Take that. My soul burns. Take him out, my Ayla. Power has awakened. Finishing strike. Dreaded dragon. Optic blast. Optic Blast! <laughs> I always love limit breaks in games. This is like, they just totally unnecessarily extra to fuck up an enemy. It's like, is there really enough space to do that in here? Like, come on. <laughs> she fucking crashes into her face. Also, welcome on by, John Nather. Hope you're having a good weekend. Yeah. Ha -ha. Oh, you thought you could dodge me, huh? I have never had this much trouble in the Tower of Lazard, Thales. I do not know what is going on. I swear I am good at this game and know what I am doing, and I've played Valkyrie Profile many, many times. Oh, that is um, embarrassing. So we're going to go for a reload, because we are starting to get a little bit tight on our times. Um, so let's see. So what if I go to this one? It should be... Elevator. Yeah! Fuck up the sorcerer. To my side, my noble Ein I love a good battle. Frigid Damsel! Frigid Cross yeah! Damsel! Das Swarm! Hey, Index! Welcome on by. I hope you're having a good weekend. I am frantically trying to keep my uh, 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 throat hydrated, moisturized, ready to yammer. <laughs> good so far? That is fantastic. And I hope it stays fucking awesome. Get through this these damn these tower. Like at this point, I've hyped up fucking Lazard way too much. <laughs> this is like, mm, shice, what, uh, what else can we do? Alright, because I need to go out and down and then left. Left. Should be a dragon here. 
fuck. Drecky, did you fuck up your notes? Fuck you. Get frozen, nerd. Well, shice. At least we have some chill beats to kill monsters too, am I right? So it should be the left one. <clears throat> Here. That's the treasure room. So then we have to take another elevator down. Down. Left. Maybe I go right. Maybe I'm misunderstanding my path self. Maybe I need to go right. Well, there is a chest here. We got Splash. I don't know what that does. Wait, don't I already have Splash? We already have Splash. What does Splash turn into? Throw. We already have Throw as well, don't we? Yeah. I see. Well, I guess that book is going to be useless. Maybe I can turn it into something more useful when I get the upgraded crafting gem. Which I think is something we actually get in here. In addition to... Yeah, I think I think we get it in here because that's what lets us make the um, other very important item. Um, right, right, down... Elevator. Yeah! I can't, that's right. For some reason, the enemies inside elevators cannot be frozen. I was like, man, I remember not freezing them. I remember having to jump over them and do stuff. All right. Let's get revenge on the explodey orb. Oh, it's another instance of the orb is in the back line. That is not good for us. Dang it, Ayla. I can't believe you missed, girl. I don't know why. Yume's, Yume's battle sounds always feel a little off. Kind of like my ability to time Ayla's dang fucking spear chuck. Okay, we cannot kill the fatal glimmer this turn. That is unfortunate. It froze though. So I actually maybe am okay with killing the Dragon Tooth. My soul burns. Let's let Ayla talk to awakened. them dragon to dragon. Finishing strike. Dragon. The question is, is this a metaphorical dragon form? Or does she literally transform into a dragon? Because if so, like maybe we actually need He's all of powerful. those... Um, Breastplates and weapons we're knocking loose of our enemies. Because she probably goes through equipment like nobody's business. You have no hope of survival. 
You fucking tell him. Alright, so if we wait one turn, if we wait two turns. Alright, alright, it's still frozen. Three turns. Alright, almost got both casters online, but I will take at least one and a whole bunch of free healing. So let's open up with magic. And we will just chain our combos to fuck this up. Because if I get another party wipe, I will probably cry. Then again, it doesn't help that we're constantly changing out our characters. Like, if I had been sticking with some of my mainstays and used just uh, event XP to level people up, my characters would be absolutely much higher level oh, and much more my capable of fucking up anything in our path. Finishing strike. But I think it's more fun to show off ever all the characters in the game. I'm not sure this is going to kill it. Oh, I'm, I'm on pins and needles. Come on. Come on. Come on, Ayla. Hey! Was now there ever any doubt? That's my girl. Ain't no fucking Voltor wannabe Tesla ball thingamajig gonna stop her. Let's also distribute uh, those um, skill points. Holy crab cakes, Ayla. Uh, I didn't realize you've been uh, stockpiling. Um, let's go ahead and get splash up just for that extra bit of damage and then we'll work on defend and avoid and let's extra into first aid because I can Valkyrie and splash you may finish off survival start working on fight because you're a fighter Um, Lorenta, you can do the same thing. Oh, man. This is, this is really making me glad I have not made any major plans for the Halloweenies, because... This, this feels like a accidentally really busy Friday, Saturday, and I kinda just wanna vegetate for the next week. <laughs> oh, I, I want to take it easy. Fuck yes, we're finally in the... Hold on, wait. Yes, we found the downstairs area. We have progress. We've made it to Lazard's secret basement. Uh, watch your step. Don't, don't turn on that UV light. We don't, we don't want to know, all right? We don't want to know. All the scorpions he has in here, because scorpions show up on UV light. It shall be engraved upon your soul. It's really fun Divide if you're in a place where scorpions are abundant to have a little UV lamp and go around looking around for the little critters. Ha! Also helps you avoid getting pinched or stung by them while mucking about. <laughs> See this foe. Depart now, you grotesque thing. Wow, Lorenta. It's already dead. You don't need to Monster keep killing it. You have served me well, my iron hair. So another one that grows up blue under UV, it's either beavers or platypus. I think it's the platypus. I know what you're talking about. Um, I, I, I'm just saying platypus just because it's the nature's uh, cha most chaotic uh, ca entity. But, um, and I believe like no one really knows concretely why. Uh, there was a, uh, I think it's, a, it's called Nature's Shorts. They do little animations of fun animal facts. 
and uh, they had they had the creature on one of them. So that's the reason. That's how I found out about it. To my side, my noble I'm I love a good battle. I also like the video they did on otters uh, because they have <laughs> they have an otter sitting there like working on a car. Um, and he asks his son to go get him the 3 8 wrench, and he goes to the toolbox and opens it up, and it's a bunch of rocks. Because, uh, otters use tools. They use rocks. And <laughs> so he hands him this rock, and then he's just, like, all seriously just, like, looking at it, and you're like, is he, like, gonna try and turn something with the rock? No, he just starts smashing the engine with the rock. <laughs> I feel like otter mechanics are not um, the first person you would take your car to. Take what, Ayla? You missed your spear drill attack. A little bit embarrassing for you. have been released. We have no reason to remain here. You know, I'm just thinking, um, Angel Curios are much cheaper than Phoenix Downs and can also work until we get, um, Guts. So that's dumb of me. This is not good. Because we need to kill both of these people in the front first. All right, let's see if we can get through both and fight the sorcerer. Mystic ha! 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 Take that. Well, butts. Well, it wasn't a whole party wipe, and she survived, so you know what? We'll take those. We take those. Give the blood servant a good old roundhouse kick. Uh, we'll send our Lorenta's little pigeon to yeah. open up this fight, and we are going to fuck this sorcerer up. And I whiffed. I fucked up. Dark savior. Mmm. Ah, doesn't look like a savior to me. All right, buddy. How am I messing up this combo so much? Killing both of our sorcerers. Great. La la la. Yeah, that's purely self-inflicted. I shouldn't have... That sorcerer should not have lived that long. Wasn't this guy that wiped you the first time? Oh, yeah, I've been wiped by one of them before. They have a full party attack they can do. That will cause real life consequences. And by that I mean it kills my character. It kill, killed my party. Fortunately, I am starting to get a little bit low on Phoenix Downs. I need to stop taking L's. Or I need to find a save place. To my side, Hopefully my our characters can get a few more levels oh, so they stop God. taking so much damage. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. All right, um, first things first, our party is way too low of life. We are going to heal. Um, we are also going to have Lorenta uh, sap guard. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to target the dragon knight. But that's fine. What was that? 
Fuck. I might need to have Lorenta heal next turn. Yeah. Which is bad, because I would like to use my magic casters to kill the backline sorcerer before we uh, kill the frontline sorcerers. Because when the frontline sorcerers are available, or are dead, the uh, dragon tooth warrior will be available to cause a ruckus. But what I want doesn't matter compared to what they will enforce. Ooh, baby. Can't use an item? You joshing me. Man. Well, better better an, Ida, an elixir than a phoenix down. Cannot use heal. This is very bad. Hopefully, you may survive. Fucking disrespect cockatiel over the face. Are you fucking with me? No shot. It, it cannot be. We might need to just start avoiding some of these battles. So those sorcerers are really ruining our day. Um, hmm. We could also spend some of our XP orb, our exporb. I think we should. I think. I think we need. I think we need our priority to be at a higher level. I think. I'll. I think I'll see if I can. What would. What would three levels look like for our people? Stretch. All right, I can do that. Glottal. And I drink hydrate. the water. And then I have to go put the water somewhere else five minutes later. All, all hours of the day, day. All, all hours, hours of the, of the night. night. No matter, no matter what, what I'm, I'm doing, doing, my life, my life is, is interrupted, interrupted by, by this. Thank you, Glottal. I needed that hydrate. And the stretch. Uh, Yeah, sure, divide. I'm gonna just reload anyway. Hope you're having a good weekend, Glottal. Today has been the world's strongest towered tower of Lazard Valis. Alright. So let's get Ayla up a bit. Let's give 19,000 experience. Divide. And then they need another 8,000. This thing is, even two levels will be a significant advantage to their survivability when it comes to how the game calculates damage. Um, let's also see if we have some other equipment we can get. There is the... Before I forget... Angel Curio. Never mind. Wow, that's more expensive than I thought it was. Damn. Alright. Um... 
Do we have any, like... I don't really see anything specifically anti-magic, to be honest. Um, let's get a couple more Phoenix Downs for the road. Really cutting into our supplies. Let's distribute those new skill points to get the stats up as high as we can for our characters to live as long as they can. For her, Lorenta. Get that up, and we want defend and avoid, I guess. Go ahead and save. How's our orb looking? Mmm, waste not, want not. We'll do one more level. I don't want to do too much because, you know, it's a shared pool and we're going to need it for our other characters. Just unfortunate that um, we have to do all of this for the Tower of Lazard because we do have two other dungeons in the chapter. Although, the way things are going, we might just finish the Tower of Lazard and put a pin in it there because uh, I don't want to do a back-to-back 9-hour -back streams. I feel like my voice will really hate me if I do that. <clears throat> as frustrating as it is to have to break things up, and not to be able to do all of the chapter in one sitting. Sometimes you just gotta take care of you, you know? Nothing wrong with pacing yourself. JRPGs have interesting complications for streaming them. Don't they just? Don't they just? might have gone in the wrong elevator again. Damn it, Drecky! Past me, why did you confuse yourself with your own notes? That's not right. Yeah, we were right there. I know we were so close to another save point. Oh, man. Went all the way to the dungeon. Noted. Let's do a bit of backtracking. Back at the top. Hey, there's how super team friend. Hey, purple scales. I am being, I am fighting the world's strongest tower of Lazard today. 
But other than that, I am doing pretty damn good. How about you? How's your weekend going? Got any Halloween shenanigans planned? I think I'm going to just stick to resting, recovering, and buying a bunch of discount uh, chocolates. I think that's what I'll do. I don't think, I don't, I don't really, I haven't really had the urge to go trick-or-treating myself these last few years. I don't know if it's just like, I'm too old, or it's just too much effort when uh, I don't have like other people to be, to be around. It feels like trick-or-treating is something you should do with a, a group of people or with some friends. I love a good yeah. Here we have a wise sorcerer unwisely not being with other sorcerers. And in the front row, I have elected to gang up on him and ruin his day in revenge. Ayla, Ayla, you can't say take that and then completely whiff your drill spear attack, please. Our work is done. This is the wrong elevator, though. I knew it as soon as I went in it. I think we should be back at the top. We are not back at the top. If I get lost in the sauce, let's get back to the top. After those party wipes, I'm just so paranoid. I'm just constantly saving. Uh. Left. Up. Left. Elevator. Right. Left. Right. Down. Left. Up. All right, we're back on track. All right, and then we should be heading down into Lazard's basement. New enemy, so we are on the right elevator. To my side, my noble Ein Harriar. I love a good battle. Richard Damron. Oh, he froze. Well, okay then. Take that. Going to a costume party for Halloween, but this weekend you're not going to work. Because I'm done with your personal art. I've got a chance to draw your original characters. In six months now? Oof. Ch Ooh. I'm doing a backspin and trying to eat me in the void. Vox, you know you can't do that. Um, feel free to swing back on by whenever you manage to get out of the void, though. Uh, it's always nice to see you around. <laughs> But that's really cool having a having a uh, OC characters with uh, some of your friends. I hope you get a good chance to uh, uh, work on that, and things come to you. I know sometimes the art process can be a little, a little fickle. Um, oh, thank you for the head pats. 
All right, so if we kill the Dragon Tooth, it's going to release the Fatal Glimmer. And buff it. I don't want that to happen. So I think what I'll do... Hmm... Let's see if Frigid Denzel freezes it. If we're in their outfit, we're gonna have to like six hours now. Nice. I've certainly been trying to brain fought brain for brain freeze. Brain brain brainstorm. Brain form. Man, I am words words happen be say things sometimes, you know? But uh I've been trying to brainstorm some more stuff. Or, uh, like, it's it's hard to see outfits. Um, like, it's really hard to see me, like, unless I have an example to look at and judge. But I just kind of feel like kind of a dick when I, if I talk to someone, it's like, I don't know what I want, and just kind of draw things, and I'll let you know if I like it or not. I just kind of... <laughs> Words aren't real. You know what? You're totally valid. That's totally right, Vox. Words are just mouth flappy noises. We all agree have some kind of, um, meaning. It's completely arbitrary. I don't want to kill the Dragon Tooth, so we're just going to end turn. Ah, I just have to eat some hits. As a linguist, I both agree and am furious. <laughs> I you know, so gotta use the gotcha life games for after the size. Gotcha games tend to have some really insane designs, though. I definitely like, um... Arknights' kind of, like, techwear kind of thing. I don't know, I'm not a fashion person. I don't know, like, the specific name for it. I think that'd be kind of cool. But I don't have the eye for, for anything design-wise like that. We're gonna leave him at a sliver of health so I can disrespect him as much as possible. So the thing is, if you initiate combat before the or initiate attack before they are dead, uh, your character will participate in the attack. If I had waited until those familiars had broken their guard to have my melee units go in for the swing, um, they wouldn't attack. Because if the enemy is already dead, no one else can join in on attacking it. So if I wanted to do some more juggling by doing the over damage, you know, shake out some more charge orbs and XP crystals, you gotta make sure you get them to start their attack before the enemy sh enemy has died. All right, we got out of the elevator, and I need to head right and down. But what's to the left? Dragon Zombie. All right. I'm going to put the Dragon Slayer on Valkyrie. Took Faction Pass for four years just so you can do better outfit designs and better cosplay. Sorry, but, ah, you no problem. It is a chill time down here. I am the only one that should be Sorry for my terrible, awful, no good gameplay. I swear I am a good player. Even if I can't yeah. display as such today, it seems. Alright, we want to open with a magic attack to break the dragon's guard. The dragon's notorious for having, um... Guard, guards I have to break. But that's okay, we got through both, and we were able to one-turn it. Um, those upgraded zombie dragons, I think they're, I, I keep forgetting to check their name. The I think that's corpse dragons. They have some really nasty attacks that hit the whole party for a ton of damage. So if it was like a normal dragon, I might actually have like just fought it normally. 
and use the low damage our characters would have done as an opportunity to juggle a lot of XP orbs out of them. But because of those corpse dragons' is high lethality and the fact that I've already party wiped twice to them, um, I, I just opted for the smart thing and equipped the Dragon Slayer, which basically almost insta-kills dragon-type enemies. It does have a chance of breaking. Thankfully, it did not break. We only have two right now. Um... Yeah, Manticore is actually not that threatening. Good player citation this. Side, Listen here, you area. little shit. You're in the oh, void. You open. don't count. Yeah. Ha. Ha. Take that. You know what? I could use an emotional my support burns. limit break. My power Ayla, has let him have it. Finishing strike. Dreaded dragon. This is me to you right now, Vox. I'm the dragon, and you're the little manticore getting fucking blasted. <laughs> now you have felt my strength. <laughs> no, I just little guy. <laughs> Too bad. Off the glass. Fight by your side. Man, I have all this broken equipment. If only I could turn it into something. Encounter Slim. Explosion! Exactly! Also, I one by Hagwood. I hope you're doing pretty good. Alright. I don't want to fight. I just want to get through to the save point. We are so close to the save point. All of you freeze! I don't want to deal with any of your bullshit. Honestly, I could actually maybe just equip um, one of our elements. That we have like seven of them. So even though they have a 50% chance of breaking. Mm, we could do that. That wasn't too strong. Here's normal magic. Thank goodness my power was enough. Only using 5% of my power. Birds make your reptilian fish brain happy. Really yeah, all of the sorcerers have um, familiars. Um, and all of them have different familiars. I love I love you, mate, because she's a mer she's a mermaid. She's a merfolk. Um, hers is a little cockatoo, a cockatiel little thing. Lorenz is a little bit basic. She's just kind of got like a, uh, 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 pigeon of some flavor. All right. All right, we'll give her that. Yeah. We kind of got cornered. It's a good thing I did that just in case. This is going to be another like four fucking sorcerers. It's not. It's just one sorcerer noted. In which case, we don't need to use the great magic. Are you mucking with me, dude? Fuck off. Mystic Clock. Ha! Ha! A pigeon of some flavor. <laughs> I mean, am I wrong? <laughs> Maximum disrespect. Killed with the familiars. What the fuck is this sorcerer's deal? Didn't say you were wrong. <laughs> ah, 
Aw, come on! No. Yeah, yeah, great. If that had party wiped me, I might have legitimately cried. <laughs> I have not been having good luck against those sorcerers for some reason. They're supposed to be very weak to fucking, uh, 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 melee, but that dude was holding the- also, John Nather, uh, good luck in the void, buddy. Um, hope you can swim out of it safely. Uh, we'll see you when you get back. <laughs> Hmm. All right, let's use a Phoenix down. Lorenta could heal in battle or revive in battle. Uh, let's not be cheap. Let's not be cheap, Drecky. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sip the void. It's not very delicious. It's just kind of a whole bunch of uh, nothingness. I can, I can be froggy when we get to the fucking save point, but we are not there yet. Sorry, wrong door. Well, uh, I meant to go this way. Let's see your- Ah! Yeah. The game likes to do that, where you'll transition zones and there'll be an enemy right there already in your face. It's a little, it's a little cheeky These like that sometimes. Your sea dragon, you think I think I have a sense- <laughs> Well, I think aquatic creatures actually tend to have very strong senses of taste. So maybe you could. All right. Um, we are going to use a bit of great magic. You can see what's so great about the magic. Lorenta has called in an orbital bombardment. Celestial star. <laughs> oh, and it doesn't just hit the one we're limit breaking on. Oh, no, no, no. Gray magic Most hits everybody. Oh, I didn't mean to hit that. Soul. Oops. Well, I guess this guy's dead. Love the deep sea. It's only salty down there. Can't taste anything but salt. Well, I mean, you got to make sure you always salt your food, you know? Okay. <laughs> oh. Is it over? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. The orb survived. Houston, we have a problem. Okay. Um. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's so bad. That's so fucking bad. We're gonna run. We're gonna run. <laughs> oh, I can't believe we just did that. I cannot hold, I need a minute. 
Oh. Fuck. Because both Dragon Warriors died, they both had their possession take effect. Fucking sending its stats to the stratosphere. <laughs> Run! Ah! Thank you, thank you, Purple Scales, for the helpful Void Yeet. Uh, we, we managed to escape from it on our first try. Stretch and hydrate. I will do this, so thank you, Glottal. Well, you can see... Oh, ha Haglar yeeted me into the Void. Well, Hagler helped with the assist, but a good idea, Purple Scales, with the run. Um, stretch. Oh, okay. Oh, we get those hamstrings. Oh, those hamstrings. Oh, they're so stringy. There's no ham. Why are they called hamstrings? Oh, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Ugh. Let me, let me zoom back in a bit. Also, this. I love him. I'm a little pumpkin. I'm a little pumpkin, Drecky. I just like pop out. I'm just like, I'm just like. Ah. 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 <laughs> <sighs> All right. <clears throat> Sanity break. All right. We're good. We're good. I got this. We're fine. Why is anything called anything? Um, because a bunch of people argued about it, and no one actually agreed. I don't know. I don't know. Things happen. Um, but you can see, because right, that's the first time we've run away from an enemy. Um, whenever we run away from an enemy, they um, they stop existing. They just kind of disappear. So that can be desired or not desired, you know, depending on the situation. You're adorable. Well, thanks. Oh, shucks. I imagine you say that to all the worms that muck around. Mother, watch over me. All right, we almost messed that up. All right, looks like our dragon sword made it another round. I'm proud to fight by your side. It is only like a 5% chance of breaking though. So, I mean, it's no big deal. Ah. Again, you're the only one. <laughs> Well, thank you. And it's certainly always nice. Uh, especially when it's a pretty busy and stressful week. He's, uh, all the way up until Thursday was rough. Ah! All right, we avoided combat that time, but Friday onward has been a balm to the soul. Uh, reaching out to people, saying hi. I feel like, you know, sometimes I haven't said hi to people in a while. So I wanted to make a concerted effort to, you know, you know make sure people know I appreciate them. Because sometimes I feel like I may not be do a good job of that. Oh, I got a save point! Hallelujah! 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 A save point! A save point! I didn't mean to actually transfer yet. Hold on. I'm pretty sure there's something on the other side of the room. Also, we are missing some items. Some very important items. What?
Oh! All right, and then there's... Right, 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 there we go. That took me a minute to remember how to do this. Uh, so the thing is, is that treasure chests, uh, when you throw them, they can break. When a treasure chest breaks, there's a chance that the item inside is destroyed. Um, so we needed to, like, pick them up and basically just drop them. <laughs> it took me a second to, like, how do I do this again? Because it's, it's a, it's a, it's a set of, it's a set of actions they don't really have you do very often. I appreciate more than you. I... <gasps> Thank you. I, uh... I'm glad that I'm able to reach out and touch lives! That is what I wanted to do when doing some streaming, is share experiences, share my thoughts, and, you know, do even more about um, connecting with people. Wait, is it Dreams Ice Launch? Dreams Ice Launch. No, I. Wait a minute, I may be dumb. I may be misunderstanding. I've met so many amazing people in other places and people who have stopped by here. I can't wait to see all the other cool people I will eventually run into and maybe touch their lives with my noodly appendages. Normalize. Yeah, this is not the place I'm thinking of. Hmm. Game. Oh. Oh, no. Now that's what I call thinking with crystals. I heard this metal is so base. Such a basic metal. First chest, third chest. I'm pretty sure going through that is the boss fight. I think there is another transfer zone. Let me see if I can go work backwards to get to because there there is an item I really do not want to have to come back for. Actually, I think if you beat the Tower of Lazard, you can't come back. No, I think he shows up next. He'll show up in next chapters. Also, Glottal, no you? Fuck. I was too busy trying to meme and shout out Glottal that uh, one of our to enemies side, touched us. But you know what? We saved recently, so we're fine. We're fine! You know what? You know what? Hit me with a party wipe! I dare you! Do it! Do it! Wow, I can't believe you would kill my mermaid like that. That's that's pretty specious of you, wise sorcerers. Um let's give Lorenta a big stick damage weapon. Do, don't do. Alright, and we're gonna soften up the targets. If you insist. <laughs> ah, yes, the party white. Man, you. I'm just gonna reload. Fuck this. You fled like a coward. Wow, Valkyrie, 
What a great death goddess. You just ran away from battle. There was another one stacked right on top of us! So we instantly... <laughs> you got to be kidding me. I cannot fucking catch a break in this tower. <laughs> I don't think you've gotten to go to Glottal streams yet. Glottal is an amazing, amazing person. And they do art and games. Uh, they, do, they do so many experiments, and it's so fantastic and inspiring seeing the things that they practice, that they're learning. Um, it's always improving on what they can do, and it's great. Um... Also, they do some great live 2D work. You know, they made a lot of their own model, the waddles, um, the jam emote that I have. Uh, Galadol dropped on me just like a microphone from orbit. I am absolutely giddy. Um, it's such a great jam emote. I'm so happy. I love it. There's also the little, uh, the little blinky eyes emote. I have it in the, uh, it's on BTTV because it's a wide emote. That one's also a glottal special, um, when they were doing some pixel art stuff. Um, and it's amazing. I love, I love the little frog, the little gnome, and then Drekki's blank expression when they hit. Just, <laughs> Tower treating you like my jobs. Yeah, yeah, I'd be like that sometimes. Alright, so... Portal left. So I need to go right up. So I need to go left up. Go left. This is a glottal that they eat a laugh that actually crit me out. That used to do as an American in the South. <laughs> that glottal is evil. So evil. <laughs> He's menacing. That's why you gotta make sure you give glottal lots and lots of head pats. You know, he... Gods. Damn it. Gus, you shadowy creature! Oh, it's the one that fucked us up last time, where we had the double-possessed, um... Dragon Tooth Warriors. Noted. Alright, this time we're not gonna fuck ourselves. We are going to kill the Flator Glimmer... ...first. Ace to meet you. And then we are gonna work over these Dragon Tooth Warriors to hopefully... Knock loose some charge crystals, but I failed because I'm a potato. What's up, I know Lupus right? Lupus is also a great person. I need to make a I need to make a hotkey for them. As well. Take that. Yeah, look at all those charge orbs! And look at all the ones that went right past our casters and didn't reduce their charge at all. That is still one persistent bug that's a little annoying um, when it happens. Freeze. Damn. It would have been really funny if that froze once again. Bill does an exit villain last, can confirm. It's a joy to hear Croton Chrono Cross. Glottal does have an excellent, excellent voice. They are not a linguist without reason, you know? They can do the talky, talky speaky things pretty, pretty cool, pretty cool and amazing like. Give me your purple orbs! Leave my mermaid alone! Fucking get roundhouse kicked by our dragon woman. Alright, this should maybe kill the 
Yeah, fuck off, Fatal Glimmer. Really glad it cannot attack from the back line. Because that would be really dangerous. Because those things can do a pretty good Voltorb impression and explode on the party. Yeah, die. You know, that's cool. Sure, whatever. Get back to drawing. Is nice seeing you guys. No problem. I appreciate you stopping on by. Feel free to vibe. Certainly do not want to interrupt greatness in progress. Alright, I want to kill them at the same time, but our characters are getting at very low health. And both of our casters are still a bit out of pocket. Perfect! So we're gonna have one of my casters heal, so everyone's back to roughly max health. No! Don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Oh, that would've been so bad. And so bloody bad. The thing is, is so the Dragon Tooth Warriors, their shtick is whenever they die, they have a death ability called Possess, which gives one of their allies, like, all of the stats of the Dragon Tooth Warrior and restores them to full health. Um, so it can get very out of hand very fast. That's why I got them very low, and I'm going to kill them at the same time. Alright, well, on the plus side, we don't have to worry about that person anymore. The other hand, um, that was the wrong direction anyway. We need to head back this way. Down. Oh! So I think this was the elevator that took us here. Um, no, this is a different transfer. That's right. We need to turn this transfer point on so we can go over here. The items I have been... Yep, yep, this is familiar. Yep. Good shit. There's no enemies in here! What's the point of this freeze trap? Creation gem! We have unlocked advanced crafting, my comrades. And it's time to do a bit of science. Alright, so we need to put the... Um, creation gem on Doc. What does timer ring do? Enemy speed will be halved. Interesting. So we put the creation gem on. Now, whenever we go to the transmute, um, the items will be going into different things. And we need to transmute the bark of the dryad. Because it gives us a Dimension Slip. Um, Secret of Damascus can turn into a Fairy Earring. I'll need to double check on that. Um, checking if there's anything else I immediately want to make. Crack Ring? Damn. Alright, so another advantage now that we have advanced crafting. So normally, so like the Fire Spell will transmute into the other version because all of the all spells have two versions um, basically it's usually like a single target and then an aoe version with advanced crafting on because we can just unequip the creation j whenever we want they start turning into different elements so our fire lance is going to become ice poison will become lightning um shadow becomes holy which is perfect we can now give our mermaid mystic cross 
one of the best spells, and I don't think we have anything else immediately work. Oh. Make a Tome of Alchemy. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, at this point, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna do that. Um... I was debating on how much I'm gonna use the Dimension Slip. I think, uh, we will put it on for now just to get to Lazard and finish that up. I'm gonna put Lorenta. You get the Ether Scepter. We will actually... Yeah, we'll, we'll just go save. We'll just save. And if it breaks, I can, I can fix that. Because we're going to be right outside the boss. All right. Now, I think we're going to go through at least one room so you can see what the Dimension Slip actually does. Look at all these enemies! That's right, the Dimension Slip phases us out of sync with reality, letting us avoid all non-boss encounters as we slip right on by. I, I still reflectively try to run away. <laughs> Everyone's ready. Let's see Lazard. Welcome, Valkyrie, my beloved. Don't worry about that pulsating mass. I'm sure it's fine. How long I have waited for this moment. My heart now throbs with the same exultation as when I first laid eyes on you many months ago. Valkyrie. Lazar giving uh, watch too much fate stay night uh, vibes. A teleportation spell. How is it that you command the lost magics? I have been thinking on this since I first beheld you. Gods who exist on the same plane as the restless souls of dead humans. What manner of being are they? Ellipsis. I have concluded that gods are very much like souls, and so I have created this vessel. Lazar is certainly ambitious. You know, you, I, I guess you can say I that for him. Shall we say, reverse engineered an elf, the vessel of the gods, to fashion this among <laughs> Just a bit of light there genetic engineering, I guess. Worthy of such an exquisite construct. Fair Valkyrie, I have crafted it for you. Th thanks? Thanks? Question mark? Me here, you slaughtered the couple on the roof? That's right. <laughs> and you sacrificed countless lives, both elf and human, in order to create a vessel for a single being? Lenith is just Why, yes, baffled. <laughs> Uh, what do you put it like that? It yeah. The goddess within you that I lust for, Valkyrie. I wish to make of you a human. It is for that that my heart burns. You are insane. How can such trivial thoughts consume you so? 
humans who seek to cross beyond their designated boundaries invite more than death. They invite total annihilation. All right, Lazard. You're about to meet your, uh, the one you love, but uh, it's uh, not going to go how you expect it to go. Oh man, you better be careful swinging your sword, Valkyrie. Shame, no matter. I can birth as many homunculi as necessary. Yeah, uh, Lazard also maybe watched Full Metal Alchemist, and uh, that's that's a derogatory because he does have a philosopher's stone, and if you've watched Full Metal Alchemist, you know how those are made. We are now fighting Lazard. And I did mention the Dragon Tooth Warriors, you know, their possess ability. Um, could make Lazard much more stronger, um, make it a little bit more difficult to deal with them. Or, we can use this Tome of Alchemy. And we literally turn our enemies into experience immediately. And then let's wail on Lazard a little bit. <laughs> I love how he screams, like, ah! ah! Now, I have things set up to where we are going to obliterate him. But I want to wait for something to show off. Um, so, I tried to do a Valkyrie-only uh, game once and there is an issue um, that one runs into with the Lezar fight it should be this next turn he does it Lazard can do great magic if you have only uh, Valkyrie profile Valkyrie if you only have Valkyrie in your party and an enemy does great magic it soft locks the game or basically just sit there charging up. Now, that was... That's yeah, okay, Lazard. You know, that's a nice little bit of uh, magic. Uh, let me show you what real great magic is. Uh, because Lorenta... So, Lorenta was a um, old professor at basically the magic uh, place on on this continent like the magical school and uh lazard is basically an expelled student because uh if you haven't noticed he's a bit obsessed and lacks most every moral really uh he's done some a lot of murder um so this is a little bit of revenge uh he also killed lorenta's husband and then Lorenta ended up dying, so yeah. That's that's the reason I've given Lorenta the the boomstick, basically. Uh, I feel like it is only poetic for her to be the one to defeat Lazard. First, we need to charge up the combo meter. No! I fucked up! No, I will not accept this. I hyped up the fucking great magic finisher and then I fucked it up at the last second. Uh, oh. Well, guess tonight's a series of disappointments. I pray that we shall meet again. So now you run? You cannot possibly believe that love can exist between humans and gods. What did you just say? Between human and god? Ooh. You really don't have any idea what you are, do you? Ooh. Ooh. What I am? Do not be ridiculous. Odin, Lord of all gods, is my father, my creator. <laughs> whatever you like. Lazard seems to have a it different idea. To me. Know this, Valkyrie. Know that you are beloved of Lazard Valet. Lazard, that's not nonsense. That's not good. That's actually very creepy and kind of stalker, kind of, kind of stalkery, dude.
You really don't have any idea what you are, do you? God, this track. I almost instantly cry whenever I hear this. Hard not to tear up. Where? That human. What has he wrought here? These created vessels grown in these magic tanks. But one of them. Yeah. This is. One of them seems familiar for some reason. He doesn't know why. And that's the Tower of Lazarn Valles. I know I will forget, so I'm going to make sure we take off our boom stick because it can break. I'm going to save. We'll say back under normal. Maybe I shouldn't have saved over that one. Fuck. Well, what's done is done. And future me will have to deal with it. Or load up our end of chapter 3 save and do everything off stream. Either way. Um, I think that is a pretty good amount of time. I... I, 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 I don't want to start the other dungeons. I feel like that's, I feel like I'd put at risk of straining my voice because I've been, I've been doing a lot of talking the last 24 hours. I think this is like, this is a good, that's a nice poignant end point. I think it's a good stopping point. We had a, we had a bit of lore, a bit of plot happening there at the end. We had a nice little boss fight. Dropped the ball a little bit in really styling the boss fight, but you know.